today's been a really interesting day. It hasn't been productive in sort of a normal sense of the word. I mean, I've managed to take a couple of things off my list, but not a huge amount. Although I know that I will be able to take some more off later today, even though it's already quite late, but okay. I met up with a friend today and it was really, really nice to catch up. But because of that, I haven't really done much. But what I have done is I cleared my desk. It's still very busy, but it's not messy. And I just made my bed really nicely. So even if it wasn't the most sort of productive day, my room just feels cleaner and nicer to walk into. I look absolutely ridiculous. I don't like the way I'm dressed today. So I'm not like in a confident bubble, but you don't need to be, do you know what? It doesn't matter. This jumper is quite cozy, although it's not as cozy as the purple one. And I am very, very cold, hence this. My feet, especially, I'm wearing socks, but it's just, I can feel like the toes are so cold. It's okay. Do you know what? I haven't even edited a video today, but I do have time to do some other stuff, even if it's not editing a video. So perhaps I'll be able to take off even more stuff than I was expecting. My phone is buzzing like there's no tomorrow. But because I've done so little today during the day, I feel really stressed about the night because that's just how I work. It's my body telling me, you haven't done enough, even though the logical part of my brain knows that I have. But yesterday I had such a fright. My mum was home, it was quite late, and we were, a couple of us sat around the table with nice warm mugs of hot chocolate. And we were just really relaxed, really calm. And then my sister went up to bed, my mum went to say goodnight to her. And so it was just me and my brother at the table. And suddenly he goes, Raquel, don't you have an online class tonight? And I freaked out. I jumped out of my chair, so scared, because usually I'm so prepared for everything. Like I've set my alarms, I've got my Zoom identity ready whatever it's called. And for some reason, I was convinced I'd just forgotten it. So I checked the time, it was 9.37, and I thought, I'm seven minutes late. Oh my goodness, why has no one warned me? Why did no one tell me? Almost started crying, I was so nervous. Then I finally saw my phone and saw it's not until two hours from now, but I was very, very scared. So I think I'm even more scared tonight that I'm gonna miss it, even though I've set extra amounts of alarms and I've double checked everything. But I just, yeah, paranoia. Oh no, ow. Oh my goodness, I have such a bad record with this tea. I just spilt it all over my, my knee. And I wouldn't be surprised if I get something like this on my knee now. Oh well. And on my bed. Oh, what a shame. Look at me, I just look like such a mess. Oh. I don't really have much more to say, except that I realized I didn't do a video last year for my birthday. And it's the only year I haven't done any sort of birthday related video. And I was telling my friend this story today, and I'm not gonna tell the full story here because it's just not important enough. But my birthday is on the 19th of October. The 18th of October was one of the most stressful, anxiety ridden days in the sense of I've always had birthday anxiety and I've spoken about that a couple of videos ago, but this was by far the worst. Among other things, I came to something five minutes late, which I hated. I was literally crying because I felt so bad for being late and my phone crashed. So I thought it had just completely broken. It hadn't, but I thought it had. And I was convinced someone had died because I went into a room. My friends dragged me into a room that was pitch black with one candle lit. And to me, it looked like a memorial of some sort. It turned out to be a birthday surprise. So then that emotion also just hit me. And not just that, it turned out to be a birthday surprise for my parents, which was lovely. It was so sweet of them, but it was a very, very anxiety ridden day. Oh well, that's life, I guess. Okay. Anyway, that's it from me. I will see you guys tomorrow with probably a better video. Bye.